full screen. No escape. <clears throat> the other game was full screen too, wasn't it? I don't know. I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> yeah. I thought so. Also, sorry nobody is going to hear any of my, like, normal laughter or screaming with that Avatar Or you are a very sensitive person. We do over. not recommend you to play this game. I love that. All right, so moving on to the next game. <laughs> Espanol. I saw, like, blood and ritual and murders and shit, and, like, I would love to watch this game and just not play it. Load faster, so... Load slower... Because it's still only 40 minutes regardless. 40 minutes of gameplay. Shut up. It's 40 minutes when this time. You jumped right in last minutes. time, though. This has better graphics, which is both good and not. Yeah, turn it all the way up. I don't want to pick up that much on our mic. It has a run feature, which is good and not. Oh, the sway when you walk is unsettling. Mm -hmm. Yes! That is an unsettling sway. Oh, oh! Well, I don't know what I, think I was you leave that on. Mm -hmm. I think no. That's that's nice. What's up, Momo? You like that game too, <laughs> Momo Jackson? <laughs> yeah, for real. That's fucking super unsettling. You hear that? I do. Thanks for pointing it out. No problem. You're, you're a credit to this team. I think the musical cue means it's close. Well, I think I have no idea what to do. And you have your flashlight on too, so it doesn't help at all. Did you hear what it was saying, though? No. No. Woo no really? It yeah, it was. Are you okay? Are you okay? Are you okay? Hey. Oh, <laughs> so this is just a Michael Jackson meme game. Yeah. That still doesn't make it better. No. So not thinking I'm gonna play this one very long. Wish I could pick up that knife or something. Right. Why can't I pick up the knife? Escape the are you okay? I can't fucking believe that. <laughs> I saw that. I saw the picture of Michael Jackson, Momo. Mm -hmm. None of it clicked. I even told you about it in the Flappy Bird video when you were talking about the Tim Allen SCP. I, t I told you about the uh, are you okay? Shut up. Please. Please. <laughs> See, I hate games where these are the mechanics. Where all you want to do is stay under a table and hide the entire time. <laughs> I heard that. that That's time. fucking awesome. <laughs> See, I don't know where to go from here, though. I think we gotta find a key to open that door. No, yeah. oh, he's right there! <laughs> Was he eating our face? What's happening? I think so. Yeah, I don't know what to do here. Keep trying. To go one more again. Like, you hide, and then you gum out from under the table, and it's right there, like... Well, the music got loud real fast. Yeah, it did. And you had the flashlight on, so, I mean... Yeah, you can... Sneaking is probably also an option. Oh! <laughs> I guess it doesn't matter if it's on or off. I guess or so. if you're sneaking or not. I think you just got bad luck and went right into his path finding that he was on. Eight minutes. Oh, that is not nearly enough. This is episode. great. All right, so this is what we're going to do.
Why well, hate like winners, winners don't game. use drugs. It says <laughs> I like games like I like horror games when there's a strategy that you can use and you can like learn what you're doing. Yeah. But when it's RNG, it's like well fuck that. I can play this fifty times in that one. I like that, it creeps me out. Why is Sonic driving the car? <laughs> so demons are involved. Mm hmm. And I think you just move and use it with the arrow keys and then press space out oh, there instruction with space or Yeah. And that's all you do. <laughs> okay. I still find it unsettling. <laughs> but with these graphics, I'm hoping it won't be as bad. It reminds <laughs> when I was a kid and I had an Atari, there was a game called Haunted House, which still scared the shit out of me and that was just dots we were also children and, and then there was another game where you don't where it was a guy trying to escape jail but like the bars were like closing in on the side and you had to shoot the bars on either side and keep them away from you well if they hit you then it's just a loud noise and like a red devil like dancing up and down with like with like a flash in the back and this is on an Atari uh, 2600 and uh, I was four. No. 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 <laughs> <laughs> oh, you found the house. That was pretty fun. Oh. That was pretty funny how it just turned around like, no. No. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this one's funnier than anything so far. <laughs> that thing gets you and the graphics get hyper-realistic out of nowhere. I mean, you can see what happens when it gets you. It's actually really cool. Okay, so I have to be looking for a key, I assume. But I think so. I mean, if the house is locked, I don't know how I would get in otherwise. There's a lot of rocks around. That would be my my suggestion. But I don't think that's how the game's thinking. Did you say I have the body of the pig? I think so. <laughs> I'm really curious to, like, go through this video afterwards and try and figure out I want to hear <laughs> until you're up in the distance that's got off the screen looking for the key it's got to be here somewhere how many screens is it before you like repeat them I don't know I don't. I don't think it repeats screens. I think it's like a big old map, and like you hit the edge eventually. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. <laughs> you save the deer. Oh, not that deer. That's a sacrifice circle if I've ever seen one. Hmm. 
Honestly, walking around doing this is unsettling enough. <laughs> God, my voice is shot. <laughs> the screaming hasn't been helping either. I'm gonna throw that out there. Would you like a lozenge? I mean, my voice was doing way better before I started screaming. <laughs> so would you like a lozenge? <laughs> probably couldn't hurt. I can get you ones, but probably after this recording, because they're all the way over there. Where the f fuck am I going? I don't know, man. Okay, maybe there is some repeating? Yeah, there's definitely repeating. So we I'm gonna let going. it get me next time. So it's the rake. Basically. More tees. More tees. <laughs> I'm gonna walk right back to the house and just see if, like, there's a way in other than the front door. Worship me! Worship me! <laughs> Poser! <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna look up online later, um... What it's fucking say? Yeah. They've gotta have, like, a script or a dialogue a list well. somewhere. Raise your cross to the well. See? Oh! Oh! He that was got close. Him. I hit it and then my finger slipped off it. Yeah, you did. Dear! Stay the house it's, numbers. it's not safe, dude. God, I cannot yell normally. Alright, so we're at the house. It's locked. And, uh... Okay, the crucifix didn't open it. <laughs> Is there a back door? <gasps> okay, I can't go anywhere back there. So most of this video is gonna be me figuring out how to get into the house. Mm. Okay, can somebody look up what I'm supposed to be Where doing? Are you ahead of you? Thank you. <laughs> I was kind of hoping you were. Just to like speed this process along, otherwise this is gonna be a super fucking boring video. <laughs> I would go the way they come at you, maybe that's uh I think I all I heard was oh fuck me like when I pulled the crucifix out. <laughs> There's notes throughout the woods, um, and there is a map. So what am I looking for to find these notes and this map? Alright, so you know go where the house is? Yeah. Uh, go back to the house, and then go two screens down, and then two screens to the right. And there's like Essentially, a shack there, and I think okay. there's one of the notes there. Where the well is, two to the right. I would go down after this one. So, uh, well, the one above the well. I have to find my way back to that. I'm trying to look at the trees and see where you're at. Huh? I'm trying to look at the trees to see where. Alright, so you're Found down the at the bottom of the road. There's three road ones, so if you go. Well, over... once I find the car. Yep, right. okay. So, so I go one above the well. One above the well, and then two to the right. Okay. Sorry for the purists who are gonna be like, oh, they're cheating. Fuck them. We're doing a show. Yeah, I'd rather. <laughs> more Whoa! Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> this is, so far, this has been funnier than it has been scary. So this is above the well, two to the left. Right. Right. 
No, correct. <laughs> oh! Well, we're back time. to the car. <laughs> Man, that would have saved me time if that had happened earlier. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know why we didn't think of that. Just get caught. <laughs> when he's driving, he's for real just looks like Sonic. He's gotta go fast. Why is he in a car then? He can run faster than the car. See, this would have been a good one to end it with. Because this one's not scary. You don't get that thing. lucky. You don't, <laughs> you don't get, you don't that, get lucky. that lucky. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> You're supposed to go one above the wall, aren't you? I thought I did. Nope. The bit crush is hysterical. I love bit crush. Bit crush saga. There's a map. There's the note. Oh. There's a There's key. There's a key. Oh, did you see it run by the window? Yes, I did. And it saved. Thank God. So what's that note There's at the bottom? Map. Or note. The Martin's house lies about a hundred yards off of Snake Meadow Hill Road. There's almost no driveway. Trees just out in the middle of of a gravel path that is mostly covered in grass. It was difficult to find the house, especially since it was already dark when we arrived. Father Allred seemed to know where he was going. He simply drove straight ahead until we arrived at the house. In the headlights, I saw an old shed off to the right of the path. Father Allred explained that he would rather perform the exorcism away from the house, but the Martins had insisted that Amy remain inside. He complained that having the family present makes it difficult to proceed with elements of the right that may seem harsh to the layperson. Hmm. Well, at least we can get inside the house now. So I have to go two back to the left and then straight, and then straight up. up. Too easy. <laughs> it really, I'm sure once you get in the house, it'll be harder. Yeah, like what the fuck was that thing in there? <laughs> that purpley boy. It looks like whatever's in that picture must be a little boy. Mr. and Mrs. Martin greeted us at the front porch. Mr. Martin led us downstairs to the basement, explaining that Amy was down there in restraints. I felt for him. There was guilt and shame in his voice. Amy was in the very back of the attic in a chair, perfectly calm, staring at us. Wait. It is hard to describe the look on her face. It was not the kind of look a child gives you. Yeah, why does it say that she's in the basement then in, in the restraints, but she's in the attic in a chair? Perfectly calm. Like, what the fuck? What's that purple? Oh. That's the There's chair. not really an interact button. Yeah, you just so got I'm the just space. Kind of moving on. This reminds me of a haunted house game I used to play on computer when I was but a child. Was it the same haunted house I was playing for Atari? Maybe. I have to look it up. Exercise that toilet, because you <laughs> know something's been happening in there. Expel the demons from my dick! <laughs> the power of Christ compels you! <laughs> the power of Christ compels you! I guess I was the only one who thought to check in the attic. When I got up there, it was freezing cold. I found Amy standing in the back looking straight at me like when I first met her downstairs. We spoke briefly, although it was frustrating to talk to her or it. I experienced a bit of deception from the demon. During our conversation, she uttered my mother's first name and in other instances spoke perfect Latin. I called for help from the others, but nobody came. So I raised my crucifix and began the rite again. Why did I grab... I don't even think Ender does anything. I'm just used to so. resting my hand there when I'm designing at work. <laughs> well, look at all the kid toys. Oh, she's got one of those little ball popper things. You roll around, just pops balls up. Yeah. Uh, I tried to push it, but it wouldn't work. Hours of entertainment there. 
Mm-hmm. And that was when I was 20. <laughs> <laughs> Fair enough. Oh, it's on the fridge. Nothing that you can get. Exactly. All right, so I think can that's the stairs. Back door? In, well, I think it's stairs in the lower corner. Oh, in the attic. Oh, look at that little... Oh, in the basement, that little oh. splash of blood. Chris, why are you making the noises? Is it because the game is not scary enough on its own? Okay, that's, that's creepy. Cutscene. She is here. She is here. The power of Christ compels you. I've seen you, demon. Oh. oh. Now what do you do? Oh, it was from the right. Yeah, sure was. Mortis. Mortis. <laughs> Mortis. Was this dude sleeping in the bed? It was weird that he chose to get in the bed. He is here. Unless it was some sort of like memory. Is it always from the right, I wonder? I wonder if you gotta get rid of all of them, like look at all of them. Or if there's some sort of flash before she attacks. Oh yeah, see this, see this game actually intrigues me. Off screen, I see. so yeah, it's always from the right, it looks like. At least the first time. At least the first time. Why you, got, why you gotta use your mouth to make word noises? <laughs> it's just his tongue a little bit, you know? <laughs> it's like Avatar, use your tongue to clean. Use your tongue to clean her wounds. I got it. Okay, so you do have to. Yeah, you gotta hit all of them. Well, Chris is right again. Up, down, left, right. Oh. Did you get all of them? It was oh. random. Okay. You just gotta hit the right one. And if you have to hit. Oh, oh. That was close. So I might. I guess we're just gonna keep heading towards the basement. We are looking at you. Uh oh. <laughs> that was one I started on. <laughs> Motherfucker. See, this game's actually interesting to me. Like, it's scary, but also not like. Are you Oki? <laughs> are you Oki Annie? Are you, An <laughs> are you Annie Oakley? <laughs> <laughs> no, this is Patrick. <laughs> okay, the right one flashes a little extra. Yeah, but the last few times it was the upper one. Well, the correct or the correct one. Okay, maybe I don't know anymore. I don't know anymore. Never claimed you did. <laughs> huh. That works. 
You're gonna have to be quicker than that. <laughs> oh, there's a note over there. Did we get that one? We are. Now we gotta look at the right one. Oh, I thought she was going to yeah, get you. Yeah, for real. <laughs> so did I. Amy's parents could not endure witnessing the proceedings of the rite for long. Mrs. Martin was hysterical, and the thing that was inside Amy was feeding off the fear. Father Alred asked me to take the Martins upstairs. I was physically worn out and managed to get them back up the stairs into the kitchen. Amy was screaming, Mother, Mother, the whole time. Finally, I got them to sit down with me at the kitchen table. After a few minutes, we couldn't hear much of anything down in the basement. So I went down to check on things. I found Father Allred lying on his back unconscious with his arms spread out wide. Amy was not in the chair. Huh. So we got that note. Is there a way to get up to the attic? I mean, there has to be. Abandon all hope. Okay, there's got to be a way to the attic somewhere. Mommy. Oh? That answers that question. <laughs> is it the back door? Or is it the front door? I mean... Or is it the up upstairs door? That's what I'm thinking. I didn't see it. Oh. It's a secret room. I think that it's right door. Here. Yep. Nailed it. Oh. Karen. The church might contact you in a few days to tell you their version of what happened to me. I want you to hear it from me first. A year ago, I was involved in the exorcism of Amy Martin. What they said in the papers about what happened isn't true. She, my superior father, with when I my superior yeah, blank father blank with she a killed blank. My superior. When I confronted her, she blank managed to cut the power to the house and blank her own parents with their own blank. I'm gonna say that last one was penises. Yes, because as we know. Biologically, you need two penises to make a child. Mm -hmm. Science. They adopted. <laughs> I have to go back to that house. <laughs> <laughs> Nightmares I'm having are real. She's still there waiting for me. I can still help her. If I don't come back, know that I love you and I'm sorry. John. So I think I'm John. Yes. Um... Oh. My God, what happened to you? Do you think my face is pretty? I have to finish what I started. She's my priest. Jump out there. Uh oh. Oh, I think you gotta stop and run away. I know Markiplier played this one recently, but I still don't remember anything from it. So run away? Uh, go away after when he when that thing comes to get you. Like, lead it away, and then go back and try it again. Oh, I see what you're saying, because it moves in increments. Yeah. So lead it, like, far away. Now go up and... Can you use it on him? No, but I think he just follows you. But if you go... I think if you just keep going around in a circle and hitting her with it, as he once he goes to get you run away. Oh. And then come back around. Okay. Hit 
Oh. Falls and facing her that time. Damn it. She's got a small radius. <laughs> Hit and run. Oh, there's another one coming now. <laughs> Hit and run exorcisms. <laughs> oh, you gotta kite him. I don't remember the guy in the exorcist having to put up with this bullshit. No, no, he just got possessed by the demon, threw himself out a window down some stairs. Right? Easy. Super easy. There's no way of and knowing the... how much you have oh, left Jesus. to do, too. Right. And they keep going in a pattern that they're not stopping, like... Yeah, you're gonna have to lead them away a bit. That's a good distance. Okay. Yes. Get your bitches over here by the ovens or whatever the hell it is. I think they're boxes. I was gonna <gasps> say, probably boxes. Ooh, what's this gonna look like? Oh, she ain't. Oh, oh. Oh, here you go. Oh, here you go. So you actually gotta dodge it when she comes in from the side. Oh! Please tell me we don't have to do the whole thing again. Oh, okay. Thank God. Woo. I was gonna be so mad if I had to do that kiting shit again. <laughs> okay. So she comes from the opposite way it flashes? I don't know, all I know is I have to damage her. Yep, so she does come in from the opposite way. So you gotta find the right one, and then she'll come in from the opposite way, try to get you from the back. And I think I do damage to her while I'm... While she's blinking red. Oop. We're facing her that time. That was a good amount of damage there. Yeah. Yeah, I got lucky off that one. Oh. They're coming in. Oh, oh, nope. Down. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that was <laughs> Yeah, you, you are hurting her there. Oh my god! That's cool. Oh! Whoa! Ha! Tell me it's a... Okay. Jesus. Oh! You can't stand anywhere you... she's about to go. You gotta oh, avoid her. Keep running around. Okay, this part's gonna be rough then. No, no like... She follows the outline yeah. of the... Yeah, oh, the pentagram. Now hit her. Oh. <laughs> I was gonna say, what if I stand outside the pentagram, but she goes outside the Yeah, pentagram. and then she does like a spinny thing out there. To like... To lay yeah. off. I love that. Yeah. <laughs> so I was kind of just figuring out the pattern that she goes in and avoiding that. Oh. Yes. I knew that was a bad one. <laughs> <laughs> like, he is right in the way there. <laughs> I sure was. Hey, she's gonna come across. Then up. And then back down. I think she still has an, a radius that you gotta be in for it to affect. Yeah. You are oh. in that radius of. Yeah, the red Lord. stuff. 
Yeah. Goddamn demon. <laughs> demon be gone. Be gone, demon. Oh, well. <laughs> Leave this child. Oh, well. Oh. She gets faster the more she's hurt. Come across, and then back up. Oh! Because of the thing hit you. There's more pissing swipes are off now. <laughs> Seriously, like it's not even scary, I'm just getting mad. Yes! <laughs> 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 For sake of sanity, what time we <laughs> Oh, what? Why are demons so fast? <laughs> it's almost like they possess powers beyond our ken or something. <laughs> whoa, whoa. Yeah, that was a close one there. Oh! I don't get that red stuff, it's it's not consistent. Right. My hand's starting to hurt. <laughs> Mortis. Oh, son of a bitch. You know this is the final boss. You can yeah, do I know. <laughs> I didn't know I was playing Dark Souls today. <laughs> I really want to see him beat it, though. Right? I really want to see me beat it. It's just that sigh every time. It <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. So you can be on the rim of it, but you can't be dead in like in that ring. I was about to say, it's not yeah. a perfect circle every time, it just... More <laughs> He's gonna watch that cutscene every time. Yup. This is a good cutscene. Right. He's gonna have a dream tonight. Of... There's an arm raging oh, out it's of gonna something. be hyper-realistic. Oh. This one's coming back. Oh, it went up there. Okay. Oh, oh she mother! Oh, she does more the farther you progress. I'm gonna get this. I don't care if this video ends up being two hours. I'm beating her. I mean, I could always cut it down, <laughs> so it's the best, so it's a little montage. You could. But don't the people want to see me get angry? <laughs> oh, they'll see you get angry. Now she's gonna go for Nope. Lie to me. I couldn't get her that time. Two, three, four, five. Oh, Jesus! Keep changing the rules on me. No! Fuck! Oh, so close. Mortis. This goddamn demon will be exercised. For my name isn't Brother Sweeter. <laughs> so, are you a monk or a priest? Yes. Because their father's the priests. <laughs> I'm a Franciscan friar. Okay. <laughs> Bonaventure style.
So she moves when the circle comes back into... Yeah, or if you're in... standing in it. Yeah. You don't <laughs> say. <laughs> Self repetitive stress injury at this point. Oh, I'm surprised. Yeah, that, that, that's yeah. what I mean by it's inconsistent. Oh. And she gets at weird angles, too. Oh, oh. Yeah. Now hit her hard. Try. Because yeah. she sits there for a while and she launches out the smoke monster guy. Oh, oh man, no! It looks in faster. Oh, man. Yeah. <laughs> that was where he got hit the last yeah. time, too. So I can't stand you there can't, for yeah. as long that time. Like that. That's exactly what you did last time, too. <laughs> it didn't even out there. Come on now, uh. soul, now! <laughs> oh, oh, the child's pot rose. <laughs> <laughs> I get <you> to go, box. <laughs> <laughs> Rob Schneider is skinny. <laughs> Rated PG-13. It took fucking forever that time. Right. Oh. Eh. Oh. Yeet! Guy, you demon! Oh. <laughs> Come on now, soul, now! <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh, she did the exorcist. She did the exorcist. <laughs> God, now I have... Well, we got past that part, so now I assume I have to go downstairs, out the back door, and see the the end oh, result. Oh, Charles Paros! To go box. Kill, Kill her. her. Oh, and there's a gun right there. Convenient. A gun with one bullet. It's for you. It's for you. Yeah. I get one shot. Don't miss you your chance to blow. One shot. <laughs> One opportunity to kill this girl and exercise that demon. Oh, well, just fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> I would say you missed your chance. I think you got to go out the front. Oh, oh, oh! There's another gun. I got it. <laughs> if <laughs> if you had two, two shots, <laughs> was there a back door? There was, but I walked into it and... Oh, she jumped out that front window. Oh. So she's out in the woods somewhere. Look at you. Bitch. Come on now, soul, now. <laughs> <laughs> Going back to the goddamn car is bullshit. <laughs> oh, wait. The pentagram? Oh, maybe she went back to the shack. Thankfully, I haven't seen the rake. Yeah, I know. Oh. oh. Who's that? Okay. Is that the right thing? <laughs> I wonder if you go back to the house if it's going to say there's a gun with one bullet. That creeped the <laughs> yeah. shit out of me. In the other room. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh no, 
there was just a guy night hunting. <laughs> Run! <laughs> you should go back to the house to see if there's a gun in it again. It's a good call. And then all the way to the, uh... The music stopped, though. All the way to the left of the well, there looks to be, like, a patch of rocks in a circle. Oh. Yeah. I don't know if that's anything important. Or... Can't go back in the house. Oh, you done fucked up well, now. Either that or I guess I'm you finished. go get in the car. Because the music stopped. Yeah. Well, what if that was the right person? Or what if it was but an innocent night hunter? I get back to the car, she's there. I walk past the well, she just grabs An arm me. just reaches up. Well, we did our and job. And I pulled out my cross! <laughs> and then I pulled out my cross! I'm curious to what my voice is going to sound like on these. You sound fine. Do I? I get hit by oh. a car right at the end. So oh, I get in the backseat. I shall not be afraid. Yeah, I knew it. Man. Ending two of five. Father and son. He killed the wrong thing. Esteemed Cardinal Gifford, with all due respect, you cannot grasp the importance of the work I am doing for young Michael without being present here. Michael needs my help now more than ever. In the past few weeks, I have made great progress with Michael's affliction. Nevertheless, whatever darkness is inside of him fights back with increasing ferocity. We must not let up the, tight, the, the fight. fight against the enemy at such a critical time. There is another reason why I dare not return Michael to his family nor let them see him. The darkness inside him afflicts his soul, but it also causes a terrible strain on his body. So that there may be no mistaking what I mean, I have enclosed a photograph of young Michael during one of my sessions. The photograph is missing. Oh, it lets you play out all the other endings. Now I'm pretty sure if you go back to that circle Chris is talking about, or if you go all the way down to the car, maybe you'll have the gun with the bullet in the car and you won't get killed. It looks almost like it's like it leads you that way. I gotta go down. Yeah, it looks like the trees are like leading you on a path. Oh, yep. Finisher. All right, all good to go. Hop in the car. Get the hell out of here. That's what I'm saying. Was that by the rock spot? I don't, know. I, don't I don't think so. I think that's a diff that's completely different than yeah, what's showing on my map. Totally. Well, is does that where it said she was? No, it didn't. Oh, I was right. just thinking that that might be because I don't think we'd seen that. So the rake is Michael. Mm hmm And the looks and sounds of it. There's also a sequel to this game. I don't know what it's called. I forget. See, this game is still gonna die right here, though. Watch. Oh, I guarantee it, Michael. Oh. Oh, because he killed a little girl. Police arrest man accused of murdering missing girl. A New York man is in custody after he confessed to the murder of a sterling girl who had been missing. Palmyra? John Ward of Palmyra was pulled over on Snake Meadow Hill. Ro Yo, this takes place in New York. Yeah. This is crazy. This, this is place... like two towns away. Yeah. yeah. This takes place within <laughs> a half an hour of our current location. <laughs> John Ward of Palmyra was pulled know. over on State Meadow Hill Road last night after a state trooper reported hearing a gunshot. The, the officer thought it might be poachers. The officer said Ward was acting nervous and suspicious after being pulled over. When questioned, Ward reportedly said, I've killed her. 
According to the police report, the officer called for backup after Ward became increasingly upset, saying repeatedly that there was a demon inside her. Ward was taken to Sterling Police Headquarters for further questioning. Ward then confessed to authorities that he shot and killed Amy Martin, a 17-year-old girl who had been missing for nine days after escaping from a mental institution. After a brief search, police located Amy's body in the woods near the now-abandoned Martin home. In addition to receiving a gunshot wound to the stomach, Amy showed injuries suggesting that she had been thrown out of the second-story window of the house. An officer who helped recover the body told reporters that Amy's face had been mutilated in a very brutal manner. Ward was found dressed as a priest when he was pulled over. It is suspected that he is impersonating... He impersonated a priest to gain his victim's trust after Catholic authorities in Rome confirmed that Ward was not an ordained minister. The rest of the article is missing. Alright, now what if we don't pick up the gun this That's time? That's what I'm thinking. And go to her. Goddamn demon misled me. Though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. Because I carry a big ass crucifix. <laughs> and it scares them away and they go, oh no. no. <laughs> this is a really interesting game. Oh. Well, what if you just leave? Can you get in front of her? Hmm. That's weird. Hmm. That's the that circle of rock. Huh. That was on a whim. Public lecture by Carl's James Osborne. Connecticut's historic connections to witchcraft, Satanism, and the beast, beast system? system. Now I'd go up north back to the thing because the spirit just walked right to her. Like, no, that look was like, what the fuck is happening out there? Hmm. It's actually on someone. Sound like Caden. <laughs> okay, so we've got an ending one, ending two. I'm just gonna fucking leave. Yeah. I wonder if there's other stuff that you can exercise. <laughs> I don't know. But you know what I'm thinking now. You're gonna shoot the uh, back in. Is to fire that space bar? Yes. Okay, how are you gonna exercise the one thing? I'm not. Okay, so you're just gonna go. Cause I don't think that had anything like I think that was just like a note. I don't know if that actually had anything to do with this. Okay. I'll tell you one fucking I mean, thing. It's right gotta now. have something to do with one of the endings. Well, I'm gonna see what ending I get after I just shoot Michael. <laughs> who is very clearly that deformed rake. A fucking part of me knew it was gonna come out, too. Therefore will he deliver me. 
I shall call upon him and he will answer me. He will be with me in trouble. He will deliver me and honor me. I can't explain what happened at that house. So this has got to be the I true one, right? Yeah. Admit that I did the right thing. Yeah, it's got to be like the true. Got the S rank ending. Ending five when of faith five endures. when faith endures. So there's another what two endings we didn't yes. get? Fuck them. <laughs> yeah, I'll look that shit up later. Uh, if anyone else wants to look them up, the endings that I didn't get are three and four. So. Police animal experts investigate chupacabra remains found near Sterling. <clears throat> Sterling Police Department is enlisting the help of local animal experts from the University of Connecticut after the remains of an unidentified animal were found near Sterling. Oh, I think it's Sterling, Connecticut. So the guy's from Palmyra. Oh, but he's just in Connecticut. Yeah. After the oh, so he's were... a Mormon. Yup. <laughs> I explains it. After the remains of an unidentified animal were found near Sterling, the remains of an animal which some residents are calling a chupacabra were discovered on Snake Meadow Hill Road by a motorist yesterday. The animal had apparently been struck by a vehicle and parts of its carcass were scattered across the road. People say they initially investigated the gruesome scene because the motorist who discovered the remains had told them they appeared to be of a person. After arriving at the scene, police concluded that the remains were of some kind of animal. As a matter of public safety, we want to be sure about what exactly we're dealing with here, said a Sterling police spokesman. This is clearly not a deer or a coyote. If it's a mountain lion or exotic pet that escaped from its owners or an animal with rabies, we need to know about it. Animal experts attached to the investigation would not speculate about what kind of animal had been found, although they come... They commented that the animal was hairless, anemic, and apparently suffered from the rickets, a vitamin D deficiency that appears in animals and children who have not received enough sunlight. I want to try one more real quick. Okay. I have an idea. That was a n nice little song they had there. I like that. That was a good chip tune. Mm-hmm. I'm going to try and exercise it, or like, use the cross on it, rather. Maybe I die, maybe I don't know. Can you exercise that well this time? So maybe all the different... I'm so... celebrating Nate and Jason's sixth birthday. Turn right and go straight past the well. Nate and Jason. Say, that's pretty much the house you want to, straight past the well, like, mm -hmm. take a right. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> he just plows right through that cruise. Yeah. Okay, just need to s stay calm, keep it cold. No, he got me. I don't even know where he came from. <laughs>